I'm Rina from Rina Yoga, and today we're going to create a basic leg stretch list. So just like any checklist, you want to think of the big ideas first and then narrow them down. And in general, since we're talking about the leg, what we want to talk about in simple terms is the four main areas of the leg. The front, the side, outside, the inside, and the back. So to stretch out the backs of the legs, the hamstrings and the calves, we're going to separate our feet hip width apart, we're going to hinge at the hips, and forward bend over the legs. So from here, just let your head relax. You can grab onto your feet, or if you don't reach the floor, just grab your legs, as long as your spine is straight and you're not overarching or rounding the back. So if you are rounding the back, bend the knees a little bit, and then stick the sit bones out and breathe there, feeling the stretch in the back of the legs. You can take five to 10 breaths here, then slowly bring yourself up. And from here, we're gonna stretch the front of the legs. So a very basic quad stretch is to shift the weight into one standing leg, the left leg, and lift up the right leg. Catch the right foot with the right hand. You can hold on to something if you need the balance. Otherwise, try to use your, your stabilizers in your body to hold you. And press the heel into the glute and point the knee down. You can take five to 10 breaths here. Deep, calm breaths. And then switching sides, shifting the weight into the right leg, lifting up the left leg and catching the left foot with the left hand. Pressing the glute towards the, the heel towards the glute and the knee down to the floor. The spine is lifted and you're pressing the standing leg into the floor. Breathing deeply and feeling that opening in the front of the leg. From here you can gently release and now we're going to stretch the insides of our legs. So you can come to seated and you're gonna bring yourself into what's called Bara Konasana, bound angle pose, otherwise known as butterfly pose. You bring the soles of the feet to touch, the knees separate, you're going to hinge at the hips and forward bend. You can press the elbows to the insides of the knees and try to stretch the insides of the legs, otherwise known as the adductors. So taking deep breaths through the nose, five deep breaths here, then you come up, and for our final area to stretch, it would be the outsides, right? So the outside, the glute or the piriformis, which we're gonna transition into pigeon pose. So bending the right knee so that the right knee is angling towards the upper right corner of your mat, you're going to shift your weight from the right hip to the left thigh. Walk your hands forward all the way down and stretch out the outside of the right hip, feeling the stretch all along here. If you feel any pain in your right knee, you can sit all the way over to the right hip and just breathe here focusing really on the stretch of the right hip. Have a great day. Again, I'm Rina from Rina Yoga. Namaste.